Welcome back guys, this is Jason, KM4ACK. So today I wanted to take a minute to take a look at one of the new features of JS8 Call. Uh, it's message storage, and something really cool, uh, super useful feature that Jordan has built into the software. So the way this works is you can choose to leave a message on a station that you hear on air that another station can retrieve at a later date and time. So let's go ahead and try to send a message out. And for the test, we're just going to send one to myself. Uh, but let's use this station here, uh, KB4MIC. We're going to right click on it and say directed to. And then we're going to come up to this option here, the message to call sign message. Uh, please store this message at your, at your station for later retrieval. So let's click on that and you'll see that it uh, populates our outgoing message box. So let's just go ahead and change the call sign. Now I'm going to leave this message for myself just for the demo here. And then we need to give it a message as well. And it would help if I could spell this morning. All right, so let's go ahead. That's going to take three frames going out. You can see that right here on your send button. You see the uh, three in parentheses. So if you're not familiar with that, that tells you how many frames it's going to take to transmit the message you've got typed in the outgoing message box. So let's go ahead and send that out. And we should see an ACK if he receives the message. All right, and right here you can see that he has acknowledged our message. So we know that the message has been stored. Now here's the cool part of this, and I was a little confused when I was first reading the release notes. Uh, the station that's going to pick up the message does not have to know which station you left the message at. Uh, I, I thought that would be a, a little cumbersome if you had to do it that way. Uh, but talking to Jordan in the forums, he told me there was an easy way to do this. You simply go up to the All Call button, right-click, and say Directed to All Call. And then you want to Query Messages. And this just says, if you can hear me, please deliver any messages you have for me. So we'll click on that, and we'll go ahead and send out that frame next. And there you can see the reply coming back in. So I didn't have to ask this particular station if he had any messages for me. I just sent that to all call, and any station that's got a message being held for me will go ahead and reply. So it's a really cool and useful tool that you could use. Uh, and you wouldn't necessarily have to know where the messages were left for you. As long as you can hear the station that has the message for you and he can hear you, you'll get that message delivered to you. Hope this uh, video helps you out and understand a little bit more about the new uh, store message storage feature in JS8. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up if you like this uh, video. Be sure to click that subscribe button at the bottom. And leave any questions you have down in the comments below. Until next time, 7-3.